Up, up and away, Web! Shazam! Go! Go! Go, Web, go! Stop! That. That is the problem. So I want to, real quick, I wanted to introduce this thing called Tuesday Talks. Tuesday's Talks is just going to be me rambling on about something random. So, you want me to ramble on about something random? Just go ahead and tell me. Anyway, today we're going to be focusing on something, well, you know, you read the title. Spider-Man is insane. And right now, Exhibit A, the spider bite. Yes, he got bit by a radioactive spider, and I have nothing wrong with that. But, it was the spider... That didn't give him superpowers or climbing up walls, but instead sending him into a coma, which is why he thinks he can climb up walls, shoot webs, and other such things. But the truth is, well, he's in a coma and he's just dreaming. Now, don't get me wrong. I love Spider-Man. I do. Who doesn't? But it just makes sense, doesn't it? How would he be able to imagine all of these great, fantastic things? The villains he fights, all of it, climbing up walls, shooting webs, things like that. It's all made up. It's all made up. But he's just in a coma. He's just imagining it all. Green Goblin is just the part of him wearing the mask. It reflects him and his double life as a superhero and Peter Parker. Norman Osborn and the Green Goblin reflects that just in his own mind. Venom reflects the dark parts of himself, obviously. Doc Ock represents the scientist in him. And then Electro is the shocking parts of him that he can have against people while he's embracing that darkness within him. All the other villains, sure, have their own cases. You could even argue that I could replace Doc Ock with the Lizard. Which is true also, but still. Doc Ock's more of a scientist. Anyway, moving on from that. Spider-Man is just the persona that he made up, in his own mind. As I said before, he's in a coma due to the spider bot he received. So, yeah. Just kind of makes sense. As a theory, I mean. All of the superheroes he's, he's fighting beside, like Wolverine, Iron Man, all of them, all in his own head. However, there is one that's not in his own head. It can be argued that Captain America is the only true hero he's fighting alongside as Captain America is and was a war hero back during World War II. And that is something that he's just remembering based off of things that he read in school. And I hear you saying, well, what about Iron Man, the Hulk, maybe even Thor? Well, Thor is easy, Norse mythology. Iron Man? Well, he looks up to Tony Stark and he wants to be a great scientist someday. Other things like that. I'm sure you're probably asking, well, what about the people he shared a secret with? Or Uncle Ben, considering the spider bite happened before his death? Well, actually, what if it happened before the spider bite? And my theory is that Peter can wake up from this coma any time, but Due to the fact that Ben's death happened to him so quickly, he doesn't want to accept it. Now, I sure, now I'm sure you're probably labeling me as a J. Jonah Jameson, which I don't blame you, but my only response is... <laughs> you serious? 
Now, don't get me wrong, I love Spider-Man. He's one of my all-time favorite characters, maybe even in my top three. But this video wasn't meant to bash the character down or ruin him for people. It's just my personal theory. Even if I barely did give him any evidence, I still think it's a fun theory. And uh, it could work if they ever wanted to do a what-if story. As I said before, like, subscribe, and share if you did enjoy. But still... This is just my little fun theory. And if you did enjoy, make sure you comment down below if you want to see more like this. I can do Goku from Dragon Ball. I can do Iron Man, Captain America, any of them. But keep in mind, this is not meant to bash the character or ruin them for people. It's just to have fun with it. I'm not insulting the character creators or anything like that. It's just because. And to restate now for listener email. and reiterate what Maybe I said earlier, Queens, writes, this is so just of anger, my and I wish own personal get help theory. It. It's terrible Don't take it the wrong health. way. Now, I know now the theory was that Spider-Man was insane, this or is rather, a common just in a coma, that I making this up as he goes along. I'm not full of he could be in this coma I'm for days, weeks, I call months, out even the rest of his life, and he chooses not to wake up from it. I because he doesn't want to accept the hard and I want it reality to be better. that his uncle is dead and in his closest voice. figures and, well, father for that but matter. Love. As he doesn't want to accept the cold hard truth that he is dead. I'm sure you're also asking, well, why doesn't he just pretend that Pursuit Uncle Ben's alive or making up in his own head as he's Spider-Man? Well, he doesn't want to because Spider-Man is Peter Parker's coping mechanism. It always has been. Think about it. In Peter Parker's life, he doesn't really crack jokes. He doesn't really laugh a lot. He doesn't really stand up against those bullies because that's as far as his reality can go in his own mind. But as Spider-Man, he can make jokes. He can be lighthearted. He doesn't have to take everything seriously. He has fun being the hero. Even if it's not reality, he still wants to have fun with it. That's my theory, at least. If you want to see more like it, well, comment down below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. After all, I have just been really making this up as I go along. I just needed to do some filler for a while, because I am trying to finish the game. Well, not finish the game. I'm finishing it on the channel as we speak. But... Just do all the side quests, side missions, stuff like that. After all, it's not like I'm film or game theory, where I can just actually pull up evidence like this. Though I could probably try to do some science behind things like Spider-Man's web shooters and things like well, there'd be no point. There's already like thousands of videos like that on the internet. I'm just trying to start my own thing. And if it's crazy theories that have evidence, then it's crazy theories that don't have evidence. Besides, we all figure something out as we grow. And as the channel gain, uh, gains more and more subscribers, we'll, we'll do some more things. New, old, maybe Assassin's Creed. I don't know. Oh! Nothing like an RPG to wake you up! Well, I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, as I said earlier, make sure you like, subscribe, and share. And don't worry, we will jump back into Marvel Spider Man as soon as I can. <coughs> no, my throat, my throat hurts. But don't worry, we'll be back soon. Until then, Red Face out.